There are just four tower blocks amongst the 10,500 properties owned by Oxford City Council. Most of the housing consists of semi-detached houses and low-level flats suitable for family living. But with so many people still on the waiting list, the council decided that childless couples could only register if they were over 35, and they've also insisted that there must be proof of a stable relationship. In terms of solving housing problems for gay people, um, and probably for a lot of other single people, it's really just the tip of the iceberg. The stipulation that you have to prove that you're a sta stable couple seems to me to be totally absurd. No married people are asked to prove they're stable and the divorce rate is, you know, recognised to be going up all the time. The stipulation that you're over 35 seems pretty crazy as well, that the majority of people who really need housing are, are younger than that and it's younger people who have less money as well um, and that to be 25 and homeless is just as bad as to be 35 and homeless. And presumably both partners have to be over 35. Now assuming that I even wanted to live with um, the person I'm having a relationship with at the moment, um, he's now in his late 30s so he'd be in his 50s by the time I, I qualified to, to live in council housing. 